Hello Gaming gente, welcome to another episode of Goblin's Kitchen. On this episode we're making molleguitas en escabeche or chicken gizzards with green banana escabeche style. Let's go over the ingredients. I am using two pounds of chicken gizzards. They are clean with cold water and vinegar. Six green bananas. Four garlic cloves. One teaspoon of salt for the green bananas. One tablespoon of salt for the chicken gizzards. One cup of chicken stock. Black pepper. Five bay leaves. And I have my water here about to boil on high heat. For the green bananas, I'm gonna leave the, the peel on. All I'm doing is cutting the tip of each end, like so. And on one side of them, I'm just gonna kind of cut it open a little bit, and that's it. I'm going to put them in the hot water. They'll cook for about 40 minutes, they should be done. Um, I going to add my one teaspoon of salt and you'll know when they're ready when the peel starts coming up of the bananas now for my chicken gizzards i am going to cook them on my pressure cooker my instant pot for about 20 minutes and let's go ahead and add my one cup of chicken stock my garlic I want my tablespoon of salt. So we'll do two bay leaves. And some black pepper. Let's go ahead and put the chicken givers in. So my chicken gizzards are in the instant pot. They're going to cook for about 20 minutes. And my green bananas are cooking. Once everything is done, we're gonna put them together and show you how the final dish looks like. See you guys in a few minutes. Hey guys, our bananas are done. So this is what they look like once they're done. They turn dark. Uh, you should be able to peel them without any problem so um, once they cool up a little bit I'll go ahead and peel them as I am waiting for my green bananas to cool off so I can peel them and cut them up I am going to get the escabeche part ready here I am using one cup of olive oil then I'm going to add two large onions I have a white and a red I have four sweet peppers and three bay leaves. I'm just going to cook it until the onions are translucent. So while my onions and peppers are sauteing for a little bit, let's go ahead and get my green bananas ready. And we're cutting the banana in about one inch thick. So this is what you're looking for as cabeche is ready. Now let's go ahead and move on to the next step. Okay, so now that our scabbage is ready, we're gonna dump the whole thing on top of the green bananas. We are going to be adding half a cup of vinegar, about three tablespoons of green olives, and salt and pepper to taste. Uh, let's just check on our chicken gizzards. That will be the last thing. Yeah, chicken gizzards are ready. Now we just have to let some of that pressure out of the pressure cooker and we can finalize the dish. Let's go ahead and add it to our green bananas and escabeche. Ok, 
Okay, so now that we have the chicken gizzards in the container with the green bananas, so let's go ahead and put the green olives in. Um, half a cup of vinegar. We are going to mix it well and we'll taste to see if we need any more black pepper or salt. Let's give it a taste. And here you have it guys, chicken gizzards in escabeche. If you guys enjoyed this recipe, please go ahead and subscribe, check out the recipes, and I'll see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye.